everything is becoming automated. You know, pacemakers, refrigerators, everything is connected to the internet one way or another these days. And people are writing software to run these things. And often the people writing the software don't have a sense of whether it's secure or insecure. And they're making choices that impact all the users. So for me personally, I want to make sure that everyone can check the security of the software they're using. I want to make sure that you know, the person who buys a smart refrigerator knows that it's not going to be a new avenue for someone to steal their credit card number. That they can install a new app on their phone and they don't have to worry about it stealing their personal contacts. For All Secure is a startup cybersecurity company hatched from the halls of Carnegie Mellon University in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. The team has been playing Capture the Flag, CTF, for a long time. The computer security version of Capture the Flag is just like the game you played as a kid, but the flags are made of data and the field is made out of brand new code. It's the job of CTF competitors to reverse engineer that code to explore and heal its weaknesses. Every year there's small changes, you know, people get a little bit better and it means you solve challenges a little bit faster as so a keep up with things, but this is just a huge leap. I mean, the ability, you know, we tell a computer go and it can find vulnerabilities in maybe a dozen programs in a minute or less, and that's just incredible. I mean, a human just can't even process that much information. That's where CGC fits in. It's exactly in our research area. We want to check the world's programs for security vulnerabilities. We want to check for exploitable bugs. We think everyone should know whether the program they're using has a problem or not. And so we've been developing these tools for a long time to not just find bugs, but find the real serious security vulnerabilities that hackers can exploit. A software bug is a security error or flaw in a computer program that causes it to produce an incorrect or unexpected result or to behave in unintended ways. And CGC is a way to feed into that vision of making sure it's fully autonomous and beyond finding the problems, actually fixing them. The team uses a two-tiered approach, mayhem, and Murphy. Mayhem uses symbolic execution to generate deep paths in the program searching for flaws. Murphy is a fast, directed fuzzer that can generate proof that a flaw exists, beginning the patching process. The team calls them Murphy's flaws. By combining two very different automation techniques, For All Secure finds that the combination is more powerful than either technique alone. They've also named their CRS Mayhem. It's a much faster way to search through programs than by hand, but there is a lot of creativity and almost art in kind of crafting exploits and doing that sort of thing. And so the real solution is kind of a two-pronged approach where you have computers and humans working together. Yeah, I don't view computers as replacing people at all. I look at computers as freeing us from the mundane tasks. So you always want that human spark of creativity, and that's something a computer will never have. But we want to make it so humans really can just focus on that spark of creativity and don't have to keep track of the little tiny details. So I look at CGC as really just upping the bar so we can focus more on those abstract concepts as people and let the computers worry about the details. If Mayhem can find the most Murphy's flaws and fix them, For All Secure will claim the $2 million prize.